The faculty at the School of Nursing have an Indigenous Health Committee who are playing the leadership role in creating the vision and the ideas for the Coyote Project. And out of that Indigenous Health Committee, they have identified some core areas. And the big one is actually looking at educating one another about Indigenous ways and Indigenous approaches so that our students benefit and their faculty benefit. So they have decided to set up a series of workshops and uh, three to four workshops over a period of time so that uh, faculty can come to these workshops, they can learn and grow and as they finish the wor each workshop then they can reflect and think about what have I learned, what do I understand, what do I not understand. It's really learning and growing together. And part of our faculty's mandate is to work with our full faculty, as well as Indigenous faculty leading, playing a leadership role, our student body as well. And by coming together, it is actually learning and growing, and it's kind of coming to the table together. I think the most exciting part of where it's taking, it's taking the university and coming together across departments so that we don't just learn as silos. And the most important part is how does that influence student learning, student achievement, and how does that feed into the community at large. The Coyote Project provides an opportunity for TRU to demonstrate it's not just its policy, but its actual voices and the work that it does as a collective university. So we are looking at within the university, but within our communities outside the university as well. So we have an opportunity to show our strengths, but also to recognize we learn and grow together.